welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII, and now we're gonna start disc four, the last and shortest disc of the game. Anyways, I'm gonna rearrange my junctions a bit. And be right back. Okay, so let's look at our final junctions for pretty much the rest of the game. Yeah, um, full life is the best junction you can have to your HP. I think it's even better than Ultima. Um, Meteor is the second best junction to your strength next to Ultima. Meltdown, Vitality, Pain to Magic. Reflect through it. And Aura is an excellent junction to your luck. And make sure that your junctions triple to your speed because it's extremely helpful. And Urban has strength plus 60%, HP plus 80%, and Auto Haste. Um, with Squall. Yeah, his junctions are pretty much the same, except he has 100 Ultimas to his spirit. And I removed all of his bonuses because we probably won't be doing any more leveling up. And Zell, because it's a half dark junction, I just junction Aura to his hit percentage. We're gonna keep Encounter Nun for, on for now. Okay, so let's go, let's go um, defeat Cypher and save Renoa for the fifth time this entire game. Yeah, let's actually take a count. Okay, the first time we just save Renoa is when Edir, um brought those Aguans to life. And Renoa was being attacked as a sacrifice. Second time, when she was hanging on that cliff while Balam was fighting Galvadia. Third time, when she was out in space. Fourth time, when she was being sealed up in that, um, Sorceress Memorial thing. And this is our fifth time. Also, guess who's our next boss? Boss time, we have to fight Edo now. Well, this boss is quite annoying because we can't use any of um, Squall's Moon Breaks. The thing is, if Renoa dies, because yes, Renoa is a target in this battle, if Renoa dies, it's all game over. So, what we're gonna do is cast Region on um, Renoa there. Because Edo will constantly um, try to draw help out of the war there. Now the reason why we can't use Squall's Matrix is because most of his finishers, um, I think Faded Circle and Blasting Zone hit more than one target, so if it hits Renoa, she's probably dead. So I have to use Zell for this one. Yeah, thanks there Squall. Now what Aura does is it allows you to get a limit break even when you're at full HP. Holy, not too much to worry about. Edo isn't really that powerful because we have some pretty good dungeons. Yeah, that was pretty pathetic. Energy Bomber, that's, I think that does physical damage, but not much to worry about. Yeah, Edo is surprisingly easy in this game. He has about, I think, 50,000 HP, so this duel will definitely finish him off. We don't even probably need 12 seconds for it. Um, let's 
try this. Yeah, that took a long time. But this is Zell's um, second most powerful finisher, I think. And Adol's dead. That was a pretty huge explosion. Hoping no one didn't get caught up in it. Nope, fortunately she lives. Here comes Laguna and Alone. So now Ultimacia is gonna possess Renola. Commencement room. Don't know what that means. Oh. Okay. Yeah, most of those save points are fakes. I think. Yeah, we're ready for the next boss fight. Just head through this door here. 